Roses are red. Violets are blue. Thank you for everything that you do. Your support is unending. And right now we're sending all of our love and appreciation to you. Thank, Thank you, you, Barb and Jen, for an amazing school year. Thank you, Ms. McCormick, for being such a great mentor. You really earned the Teacher of the Year, and this really inspired me to obtain the qualities that you have as a teacher. And you really brighten everyone's day, and I also am very thankful that I could steal supplies from you every single day. And not only were you a great mentor, you were also a great friend, and I'm very thankful for having you. Gail's been an absolute delight to have. She's been wonderful in making you feel comfortable in the Norwich City School District as a first year teacher, and she's been really um, approachable and I can go to her when I need help, whether it's with school or a personal thing going on. She's been really great in making me feel at home here, being that this is new to me, new area, new home, new everything. So she's been really great in making me feel at home. Well, one of the things that she's helped me with is the way she organizes her classroom and behavior management, I think. The way she approaches children and her ideals on how to manage children in the classroom has been really effective and I've kind of taken her own strategies and used them myself and they've proven really effective and have been great and I think as a mentor she's taught me countless things but it's hard to say <laughs> what one thing has been really I guess crucial in my own teaching because I feel like I've taken so much of who she is as a person and as a teacher and applied them in my own classroom. Well, thank you, Gail, and I could not have asked for a better mentor. It's been a pleasure having Mary Williams as my mentor this year. Even before she was officially made my mentor, during the summer she offered to give me assistance as I started the new school year. She came in during August and was able to talk to me about what kind of classes I'd be able to teach um, and offered me assistance back before I even had any students. Since she was made my mentor, she's offered a lot of help. Um, she's helped me with lesson plans, she's talked to me about specific students and how I might handle them, and she's really been an ear to listen to any of the complaints I had or any of the problems that I might have encountered. We share an office, and it's been great having that access to her. I had a million questions this year, and she always went out of her way to answer them. She would drop whatever she was doing to help me with my questions. What I really appreciated was that when she didn't have an answer to something, she would even help me find that answer. She didn't leave me to my own devices. And it was a major help having that person that I could go to whenever I, I had a question about something. She is somebody very well respected by her students. She puts a lot of time and thought into being a good teacher. She spends a lot of time in her classroom after school. And she's been a great role model for me to see how she put so much time and, and care and passion into her classes and her students and it's been great getting to see that in my mentor. Kim Summers has been terrific for me as a first year mentor. Part of the reason why is because she's so detail oriented and understands the material that she's teaching. And for me as a first year teacher, it's difficult to come into a situation and be able to teach from day one. So she has provided me with the support that I need to be a more successful teacher. One of the things that I've liked is that she always has a very positive attitude and outlook on the day. Uh, I know that if I'm coming in, maybe I've had a long drive coming in, talking with her for a few minutes will kind of cheer me up and get me ready for my day. Um, I feel that I have improved as a result of her mentoring because I now understand what is important to teach the kids um, as far as it goes from a module standpoint because of many different aspects. Ms. Thorpe has been so wonderful to work with through the mentor program. She's been extremely helpful, not only in school. Um, one of the things that I've loved about working with her is that I can call her up on the weekend or at night, anytime that I need to talk about school, and she's been willing to help. Um, she's great to work with. She's great to talk about ideas with. And I think we've worked on some really good things together this year, building great lessons and great units and plans for our students. So I. She made my transition um, into my first full year of teaching very smooth and very comfortable, and I'm really thankful for that. I figured I'd take you through our year unit by unit. We started with a mapping unit, and I started with a longitudinal move coming from Unadilla Valley to Norwich in October. I changed latitude many times going north and south between her classroom and mine. Yes, they are oriented. 
out. Next came the astronomy unit. She helped me reach for the stars. Helping to point me in the right direction as a sailor uses an astrolabe to guide his course. Kathy also reiterated the fact that the shift in the common core has absolutely nothing to do with the Doppler effect and redshift and blue shift. Her guidance helped me avoid any big bangs during the school year, helping me change from a nebula to a storm. Next came the weather unit, and she helped me weather all that DDI and that flood of information that we did obtain from doing all those DDIs during the school year. Now one of the last units in Earth Science is the Geology Unit, and she helped me get through that Geology Unit as well. But as the school year eroded, I realized just how nice Kathy was. And just remember, it takes a great carpenter to help build a very successful school year. Okay, my mentor is Wendy Swingle, and I have truly come to appreciate all the help that she has given me this year, um, from the simple things as what on earth is a milk list if it doesn't have anything to do with ordering milk, and sharing strategies for struggling math students, um, to um, working with a cafe reading strategy to address the needs of student accountability. And she's really eased my transition into second grade, and the team overall has been very helpful. And I want to thank Wendy again for all she's done for me this year. Um, she has a great sense of humor, and I love her willingness to do whatever she can to help. She has been a true blessing. Thanks, Thanks Mr. Wilson, for being wonderful, intelligent, lovable, sarcastic, and organized. Notorious, but needed.